hello everyone uh welcome to my channel i your best predicts uh so in today's video content i'm going to show you guys how to predict home or draw double chance betting strategy uh actually i uploaded an, uh, a video earlier and uh i had to remove it uh, due to some reasons so uh without wasting much of our time i'm going to be making use of most of our available games and uh most especially uh for the major leagues that we are all aware of and that we are mostly familiar with so we have some games here and uh but for easy access let me just quickly click on so so i'll just be making use of five uh matches for an example in this video uh, so i want you guys to make sure that you pay a very close attention to this strategy and make sure you watch this video from the beginning to the end so that you won't miss any part of the step so i'm going to use some of our major leagues so first thing you need to look into if you are going to be predicting a double chance check uh the home team uh if the bookmaker are favoring the home team we are only going to be pre predicting our uh double chance on the home team that is home or draw betting strategy so check if the bookmakers are supporting the home team so in the case of newcastle uh versus uh brighton you can see that uh, newcastle was given a note of 2.00 odd to win the game and brighton was given 3.74 odd so what you just need to do is click on the game that you want to predict their match you click their statistics so after clicking the statistics there are three things that you need to look into the first thing is check their position on the league table check who is leading the second thing is check their form and the third thing is check how these two teams have been performing while they were playing at home so checking out their form newcastle is currently in form compared to that of the brighton and checking out their league position uh, newcastle is leading brighton so if you are to check their previous meeting i think brighton has more winning compared to that of newcastle but now let's see how newcastle has been performing while playing at home so in one of their game newcastle played uh they won by two goals to one and the second one in 2020 they lost by three goals to no so if you are going to be predicting your game on a team maybe the home or draw make sure that the team you want to predict your home address strategy on make sure in their last previous match with their opponent make sure that they add either win or draw throughout so in, the, in this case of our particular stats i would like or advise you guys to stay away from this kind of stats and uh, let's check for uh, a new pick so we have uh, the match between Tottenham versus our uh, Brentford i think without wasting much of our time Tottenham is currently not really in form so i'm going to skip that now let's check let's let us look into uh the match between fulham versus crystal palace fulham versus crystal palace the next thing you need to do is click on the statistics so my main target in this video content is to make sure that you guys get the actual message i'm trying to pass to you guys so clicking on the statistics don't forget the first thing you need to check check their league position the second thing is check if the teams you want to predict on they are in form and the third thing is check the home team while playing at home how they've been performing so well if they have been performing very cool that means they are good to go or you are you are free to predict them as win or draw so in the case of fulham versus uh crystal palace fulham is currently not really in a good form compared to that of crystal palace but they are leading on the league table and checking on their previous meeting uh fulham has fulham lost twice while playing at home uh first one they lost by two goes to one and the second they lost by two goes to no so in this kind of statistics you have to stay away from it and let's let us check on other games so uh let us look into uh, the match between man city versus chelsea manchester city versus chelsea 
and let's check if the home team can actually uh, have the upper hand in this situation so the next thing now you need to do is click on the statistics to see how it goes so now checking on that stat <coughs> sorry <coughs> checking on the statistics uh, you can see that Manchester City are 87 percent form and they are leading on the league table compared to that of Chelsea that are still struggling with their form and that uh, looking into their previous meetings uh, while Manchester City was playing at home they lost uh, no they won all the three games they played at home the first one they had is a uh, 4-0 another one two zero another one one zero so you are free to predict this game as manchester city to win or draw as this so now the next thing you need to do is let's check other games for that so let me go for other leagues So under the Italy Serie A, we have the match between Juventus versus US Cremonese. And so if you are predicting your own more draw betting strategy, click on the match. The next thing you go to the statistics and don't forget what I told you guys. In order not to miss any step of this video, make sure you understand the steps very well. Make sure you are able to avoid some uh, uh, some factors that can spoil or uh, cut your ticket. So the next thing you need to do is uh, check the form, check the league position, and check their previous meeting. So checking on the form, Juventus is currently in form compared to that of Kremlin's, and Juventus is second on league table. And uh, looking into their previous meeting, uh, Juventus has never lost to uh, US Kremlin's while playing at home. So you are good to predict this game as a uh, Juventus to win or draw. So uh, let's check on the match that the bookmaker are supporting or are giving a favorable odd. So in the situation of Sassuolo Casio versus AC Monza, now let's check their uh, statistics to confirm if uh, they have uh, a favorable uh, form and uh, if they are in a good position. And after that, we have to check their previous meeting. So looking to their form, uh, you can see that the home team is currently in a bad form and uh, in this kind of situation, I would just advise you guys to just stay away from this kind of games and go for other games. Now let's check. In the situation of uh, Atlanta versus Elas Veruna, so we have to check their stats and to confirm. So probably I will try and make sure that I use this particular strategy to predict sure triage for you guys. At least I'm going to try my best to make sure that I predict short triage for you guys. And I want you guys to keep following the steps so that you won't miss any single tips and keep winning with this particular strategy. So checking on this, Atalanta is currently in a better form compared to that of Elas Verona. And I'm checking on their previous meeting. Uh, while Atalanta was playing at home, they lost twice. So my advice for you guys, this particular game seems to be a kind of a dangerous and uh, very technical. It can anything can happen in this kind of situation. So uh, let me go for something. So US list versus Spezia Casio. Look into their statistics and let's see what they have there. So, uh, looking into the form of these two teams, they both have the same form, but the home team is currently leading them with just a gap. So, uh, looking into their previous meeting, while Leeds was playing at home, 
uh they won yeah they won uh, so uh we have the home team as a favorable team to win this team or draw so sorry for the digression So we have another match up between Torino FC versus ACF of Fiorentina. You know, everybody knows that Fiorentina are currently outing this time around. And uh, <laughs> looking to, into their previous meetings, they've been winning their games. And uh, they're in a very kind of a good form. But let's check uh, the form and the league position to see how they've been performing so far. Wow, Torino is currently in form, in a better form compared to that of Fiorentina and they are leading on the league table. Now let's see if Torino has been performing so well while playing at home. Torino won by 4 goals to know and they draw a particular match. Actually, this is a perfect match to be predicted as a home or draw. So with just four games, we already have our sure two odd. And the next thing I'm going to do right now is to make sure that I am able to predict three odd for you guys on today's video content. So the next one we have here is a Napoli versus Inter Milan. Napoli was given an odd of 2.71 odd and Inter Milan was given an odd of 2.71 odd. Now let's check the form of these two teams and let's check their public position. We already know that Napoli are uh, already the number one on the league table and... Uh, but I'm doubting the form. So surely Inter Milan is currently in 100% form. So and Napoli are they are in 53% form. Without wasting much of our time, I have to just leave this particular game. Now let's check into other leagues and let's predict our other games. Uh for the Spain League, uh, we have. Um, the match between Real Betis versus Rio Vallecano, and uh, don't forget the first thing you need to check league position, the second thing form, and the third thing their previous meeting. How they've been performing so well in their previous meeting. So, now let's check that right now. Looking into the form, the away team is currently in form compared to that of the home team. And uh, looking into their previous meeting, uh, the away team, the home team was performing so well while playing at home. But I won't recommend it, uh, you guys to play it because of the form. Taking into the consideration of the uh, match between Cardiff CF versus uh, Valladolid, uh, let's check their statistics and let's decide on the outcome of the match. So this kind of game is in no way to go because of their form. We have to skip that. So that's how I want you guys also to be skipping some games that you cannot predict. There are some games that require you guys to skip even though they seem to be enticing. You know, sometimes you just see games that are surely this team is supposed to be this team. But actually that's not how things always are sometimes i know you know uh, i'm sure you guys know that anything can happen in betting but there are situations that the possibility there are, uh, there are things there are things that you can do to increase the possibility of the outcomes of your bet so that's the reason why we make use of our strategies so we have the match between athletic bibao versus seta vigo uh, currently set our athletic bibao they are in 27 percent form and they are leading on the league table compared to that of seta vigo and the Seta Vigo they are in a 20% form and they are checking on their previous meeting Seta Vigo uh, they lost by two goals to no twice wow my people my audience I want you guys to just make a skip of this kind of match just skip this kind of match uh, so we have the match between Ajitafe versus LCF 
don't forget what i told you guys to go always do check the statistics check the league position check the form and check the previous meeting so i'm going to do that right now i'm doing that right now so let's do that together right now i'll check in on this you can see that the way team is currently in the form but uh the, on the league table they are below so just but due to the form make sure you always con consider the form that a team they are having currently so that is the reason why i'm going to skip some games for that so let's look into other games let's check for rayo valecano versus espanol looking into the statistics of this and um let's see how it is and how it can be actually the home team is currently in the form and leading on the league table and uh, checking in the previous meeting uh while Ryo Valencano was playing at home they won they only played once actually this game can be in a favorable side of the home team now it can be predicted as the home or draw so with that we have 2.69 odd so we just need one more game to complete our prediction so now let's check other leagues for that so let's make use of um leon versus monaco don't forget we are only predicting our games on the home team don't forget that we are only predicting our game on the home team so uh this time around we are predicting on uh, our leon versus monaco so we we'll go to their statistics to check um uh, the form of the team we want to predict on Actually, the away team is leading on the league table, but the home team is currently in form. And uh, checking in their previous meeting while Leon was playing at home, they won once by two goals to no, and they lost by two goals to no. But me, I'm going to skip that because of their league position and because of their performance in their previous meeting. So uh, let's check another one. In the situation of, uh, I think, Nantes, Nantes versus Montpellier, Let's check their stats and let's check their form, their league position and their previous meeting. Wow, Nantes, which are happens to be the home team they are in currently in a very bad form very very big and bad form so we have to just skip that and move away from the game let's check for some other games that can give us what we want let us check the situation of freiburg versus our wolfsburg Uh, looking into it we can see that the away team is currently in a better form compared to that of the home team you have to skip that let us take uh let us take uh the situation of atta berlin versus our vfl bochum our let me say bochum into consideration
so we are having some kind of very bad games these times around but i think i'm going to make a stop here because of the situation because if we keep looking for games like this this will take a lot of our time and uh, we have with just five games we are able to gather 2.69 odd for you guys on today's video content and uh, using the particular strategy of O or draw betting strategy actually i have something else that i want to show you guys using a uh, betting strategy doesn't mean that uh, surely uh, you will always win in betting we cannot escape uh, the situation of losing either you win or lose i can show you something uh, that will interest you guys because i've done so many uh, research on the strategy so i want you guys to learn how to make use of money management that is setting budget for yourself there is a particular game that i use in testing uh, this particular strategy and uh, i play some games and i lost some games and that's how betting works it's not like every time uh, you always win every time i do lost and i do i win sometimes in this kind of situation i make use of oh more away sometimes and oh more draw double chance strategy and sometimes i used to lost uh, it's not like every time i play i win that's that's betting for you guys so the best uh the home order betting strategy is a kind of a strategy that i just discovered recently and i have been testing it for a very long time and a very long a very very long time in the process of uh deriving this particular strategy i have lost so much money on it i can show you my best history uh for for the reason of uh, losing in order to derive something better for you guys this is my uh this is my bet history while i was trying to test the old modro betting strategy this is the situation these are these are the things i face i make use of different strategy before i usually come into conclusion of uh concluding on the particular strategy i do test strategy very well and that's how uh that's how uh, i'm always able to get what i really want so this particular strategy is actually what i just derive in the course of testing the strategy throughout today so thanks for watching these are their best predicts uh see you next time on the next video contents after making research on uh, the next video uh, uh betting let me say betting strategy that is going to interest you guys so thanks for watching until next time see you again